Prayer with Apostle J.B. Makananiza. Touch your screen now. Ask someone and say you are responsible. If you want to be promoted in the spirit, check your responsibilities. Check. Check your responsibilities. Me and Mama, uh, like I told you that when I was still working there, and then in Pretoria, and then I attend another church here of one pastor who used to speak Tosa. It was a Tosa. Me and Mama reached there. We found all Christians. And then from there, when we look around, we see pastor doesn't have food. And the offering that people were giving shows that, shows irresponsibilities. People, they don't care. Sometimes God does not bless us because he wants to bless us. He bless us according to, you know, the vacuum that we have in our hands of responsibility. So I, my wife told me, I say, hey, this pastor is dying of Allah. And as long as we are here, we are responsible. We need to do something. I said, okay, what are you going to do? Okay. We need to be close to the pastor and then let's bless him. Ah. So I stood up in the church and said, please, we want people, we can buy grocery and then let's buy grocery for the pastor. And, you know, it was not long I was in the church. I was Mafiki zone. And there are all crooks there. Not, not crook, crooks were there. And I'm Mafiki zone. And I, my wife was the one who said, let's do something. And then I stood up and told the church, hey, after church, the old crooks, the confused ones, began to tell us the history of the church that has confused them. And began to say, you know what? You, are in, you don't know us. You don't know this pastor. Uh, uh. This church divided three times. You see, you are coming now. You are, you, are, you are following on the fourth group. I ask, where were you? I was there. Ah, why you don't go with others? I mean, if you were there, you were supposed to be steady with the pastor. So what you want to do, it won't work here. Ah, eh? eh. oh, it won't work here. People will fight you here. I said, oh, we are not doing it for this pastor. We are doing it for God. I don't know if you're hearing me. They were asking themselves questions. Pastor, when he says that we are doing it, we don't care. They, no one came. We stood together. We did it. From there, pastor started to be close to us. Now we started to visit the pastor. Now we see enough how pastor is suffering. We were responsible. When you reach to heaven, you will be asked that question. Were you responsible? And your answer will be, of what? Jesus spoke about it. That in the last day, people on the right side, I mean, it's written in the Bible, they'll be asked, you were seeing me. You were seeing me hungry. You were seeing me in prison. You were seeing me. And they say, ah, we never saw you. He says, no, you were responsible to those ones. You have done it to those ones. You have done it to me. Look how many times we might have failed. Failing God. Lift up your hands. We ask God forgiveness and the direction of our response. Prayer. Let's ask God forgiveness and the responsibilities of our let's ask God
and ask God to give us direction of our prayer. You are responsible. I can't hear you pray. You are praying down, down, down. I can't hear you pray. You are responsible. In Jesus' name. Look here. Many people are crying for their eyes to be open in the spirit. I mean, even old people, even young people, but they are just failing on what they are seeing. They are failing in a simple test. What they are seeing in the physical. When Jesus spoke about a man who was injured and a person called Levite passes on the side, he was talking about responsibility. And there comes a Samaritan that can be considered as demonic and become responsible to bring solution to that man. Can you see how far we are today? We are so selfish to ourselves. Even our Christianity is like that. Let's lift up our hands again to God. We ask God forgiveness. And ask God to direct us to our responsibilities. Prayer. When you pray like that, God is helping you. What a mighty God we say. What a mighty God we said the angels bow worship and adore what a mighty God we said What a mighty God we say. Yes, Lord. What a mighty God we say. The angel bow before. Worship and adore Him. What a mighty God I say. This mountain, this mountain has been removed in Jesus' name. This mountain has been removed, Jesus' name. This mountain has been removed by my spirit, says the Lord. Not by mighty, not by power, oh, by your spirit, says the this mountain, this mountain. 
has been removed in Jesus' name. This mountain has been removed. This mountain, this mountain has been removed. Ooh, by my spirit 